Hey everyone, what's up? This is going to be a video about player own ports. Um, they came out yesterday and I thought I'd make a video because I'm pretty bored and I thought why not talk a bit about it because it's probably the best update of the year and <laughs> that's not really hard to do since there's only been like five updates this year and they was all low level quests that have just had different graphics. But I don't know. I tried it out when it came out, which I don't usually do with updates because, I don't know, I don't really like wasting time, but I don't know, it looks quite good, the graphics are pretty good, there's like a few cutscenes and stuff that look pretty good and it's all voice acted which is good, I seem to put quite a lot of effort into it, but the first thing that I thought when I like went there is it feels like you're playing Farmville or something, if you've ever played Facebook games you'll know what I mean, you like you do things and then you come back and then you do it again and you it just feels like there's a game on Facebook don't ask me how I know this and my phone's ringing but oh well I'm not going to answer it there's a fa uh, game on Facebook called something to do a Castleville or some shit and it's so much like that but I guess that's good because people kind of get addicted to those kind of games but basically you just need 90 in fishing, slayer, runecrafting, smithing, I don't know, a few other things, at least 90 in one of those and then you can upgrade your ports and all that good shit and I don't know, I've messed around with it a bit, done a few, a few voyages and ended up failing but I'm getting used to it now. I usually just go there after I bank when I'm fishing, which it takes like two minutes to just set up another ship and send it out. Haven't got anything back at the minute. I think you need to unlock um, further into the map before you can get scrolls and stuff to make the armor. As for the armor, that sounds pretty cool. Um, I can't remember what it's called, but there's a untradeable version and a tradable version. Obviously, the untradable version's better and both sets degrade, but you can repair the untradeable one. The other one just disappears, which I don't think many people are going to be using because it's not hard to just check your ships every... I don't do it as soon as I can. I usually just do it when I can be bothered, so like every hour I'll just go there. It's kind of like your kingdom, but more often, if that makes sense. But yeah, I don't really know what to upgrade. I think before I go hardcore at it to get the armor and stuff, I'm going to wait for guides and stuff and wait for people to work out the fastest way because there's always a way of doing these things that are a lot faster than when they first come out. Like like Mobilized Armies when that came out, everyone was playing it properly and then someone worked out that you could just AFK and get your ranks up. So I'm going to wait for that. It's all good. Um, there's Rocktail Soup as well, which I don't think loads of people are saying that it's going to make Rocktails go up, but it's not because they only they don't heal that much <laughs> heal that much more than actual Rocktails. So I don't know. I, I think people are still going to use Rocktails to be honest, and it's not going to be worth it. And it might be good cooking XP. I don't know, but I don't deal with Rocktails anymore, so it's all good. Um. That is pretty much it. It's pretty straightforward. The tutorial is really good as well, actually. Um, because if it didn't have a tutorial, I think it'd be like really confusing. But it walks you through it pretty well. And yeah, I'm, I, I quite enjoy it. I think it's pretty good. Obviously, there hasn't been that many updates to, for it to be better than. But I don't know, it's quite a nice end to the year. I don't know what else I've got planned for this month. I don't think it's much. So, yeah, I guess this is the biggest update of the year, and it's not, like, amazingly fantastic. Fantastic. I guess it depends how long it's going to take to get this armour. But I reckon you could probably get the armour in, like, a week. Something like that, which is pretty crazy, considering it's better than next sets. But, um, that is pretty much my opinions on this update. I, it's a pretty pointless video, but I haven't done a video this week, so, yeah. I tried to stop saying it's all good because I know I say that a lot and someone said that I say that a lot so I've tried not to say it because damn um, if you enjoyed the video remember to leave a thumbs up maybe leave a comment below saying what you think of the update was it good have you found any cool items or those scrolls that you need I don't know 
I don't think anyone has the scrolls yet though, so we'll see. Um, I guess this will do. Rose Tundra Mill Fishing will be up on Sunday. I'll probably have more videos in between then, to be honest, because I've been pretty bored this week. So yeah, cheers for watching, guys.